Hey, it's Bunny Hi. Welcome. So, I just wanted to do a quick little update about my kitchen. I'm really excited about it. Um, it's uh, like I love spending time in my kitchen now. So, I have a couple different things to show you. I know you can hear something in the background, but it is awesome. And there's a reason why. So, I tried to find everything that I got recently. Um, I'm trying, I feel like I'm forgetting something and I don't know what it is that I got, but I finally got a sink in my kitchen. Like, okay, so I had it originally, no bricks, just by itself. <clears throat> Ish issue was the drain pipe was bent too much because I'm draining it out the window, which I'm thinking of an alternative, but right now that is temporary, but, um, yeah, so the drain runs out the window, so it's like a portable little sink or whatever. Um, it's connected by a water hose. I have cold water right now. I don't have hot water, but... And then this little um, faucet I already had previously um, from when from when um, I had my original sink, and I don't know if I have shared that on this channel, like my original original sink, um, my original background sink. Um, bathroom sink like the original one it had that faucet on it but I took it off and I put it on this sink um we already had this sink it was <clears throat> taken out of my mom's side of the duplex because she didn't like it in her bathroom and it's been sitting in the basement for a while now and we have a couple different sinks like my old sink the one that I originally had we have this one and then there was another one we got but it doesn't fit really anywhere so okay so we I raised it on these bricks which I'm gonna cover up that brick part I had some leftover like tile that I did in my bathroom and I put it on top of that um, so it's still kind of unfinished an unfinished look but yeah now I can wash my dishes in my kitchen it helps so much to have a sink in the kitchen um, it's amazing. So, yeah, the next thing I want to show you is this. That's what's making all this racket. It is one of these old school, like, fish turner machines, whatever. Um, and it has ocean sounds, which I can turn down. And now you don't hear anything. Or you can turn it up. And 
It is so relaxing. This isn't the permanent spot. This just happened to be the spot that I put it in at first. I'm still trying to figure out where I'm going to put it. And yeah, so I think it's awesome. Okay, and then the next thing I got is this little, like, charm box. And I got it for $2. This was $7. But I got this for $2. It has writing on it. I still have to, like, really deep clean it. Um, but it's metal all the way around and it has like this ribbon it says so for the mother so for the mother's sake the child was dear and dearer was the mother for the child. I don't know if this was an urn, like where people put ashes or whatever, but right now I have my necklace in it. Um, but I love it. Like, I love the bow and just, I love hearts and it is so cool. It looks so fancy. I don't know. It could be haunted for all I know. But yeah. Oh, and then I have a candle collection. I've been lighting candles. Like this one. Let's see. This one's Dark Moon. And I got these from the Dollar Tree. This one is the Feminine. La Feminine. This one's for Tranquil. Um, I have one for Love. But I already used... Oops, sorry. I already used, I already used the one for Love. <laughs> because, you know, whatever. Maybe, um, <clears throat> just putting the vibes out there, you know what I'm saying? Just putting the vibes out there. Anyways, I really wanted to show you guys this stuff. I, when I installed the sink, I cracked my floor. Luckily, I do have two replacement tile to... Um, put down but the sink fell down when I installed it and I do have ceramic tile and it cracked it so it's not really that noticeable but like right there it's cracked look Which, I'm always going to have a rug in here anyways, so I'm really not that worried about it. Like, it's not like an emergency thing. I am OCD, so it's always going to be on my mind. But, um, it's not something I'm really running to do right now. My... Uh, next thing I really want to do is to get the hot water running on the sink. So, that's my next thing. But, I'm really happy I have a sink. It's really high. I wish it was a little lower. But, I'm working with what I already have. Um, so, I already had the brick. So, I used that and 
the issue was when I had it on the ground before, the water would halfway drain and it would get stuck in the drain pipe. So it wouldn't drain all the way and it would have like water um, still in the sink, not drained or whatever. And then this morning I had an epiphany or whatever and I was like, what's wrong with me? Raise the sink up and so the water can drain. I don't know why I didn't think of that before. But the bricks were the only thing that I had. And I'm just, I'm gonna deal with it. I don't care. I feel like it's too high. Like it kind of bothers me. But it's also like arm level or whatever so I don't have to like lean over which is good so yeah all this stuff I already had and I just okay so what happened was originally why I didn't have a sink in my kitchen was because um There are, there are five or six components <coughs> that I had to put together to supply the water to the sink. And the components are, well, what I paid were close to $40 and that's just like the connectors that doesn't include the water hose I already had the water hose so in that aspect I was blessed I already had a water hose um, but now <clears throat> um, to get hot water I need another water hose and I need to buy all those components again to get hot water supplied to the sink. And that's my next goal is to get hot water. But now that it's elevated, I don't have drainage issues. Um, everything works great. There's no leaks, no nothing. And it's been a process because when I installed it, I was getting so frustrated because it was leaking everywhere. And I was like, oh my God. And like, I was like tightening stuff, like tightening, like, I'm like, why is it still leaking? I use plumber's tape. <laughs> Let me tell you something. <clears throat> if you got a leaky pipe, buy plumber's tape buy plumber's tape you will save so much money and time it's amazing plumber's tape really it's crazy but I have now I have a water hose line that goes all the way down into my bathroom so I'm going to cons <clears throat> I'm going to conceal this um, so that it's not like noticeable. But it goes all the way into the kitchen like a pipe, and I have water. I love it so much. I am so in love. I finally have a sink in my kitchen. And that calendar my mom gave me, so don't even judge. She thought it was supposed to be something else, and it's not. It's a weird calendar, but I don't have a calendar, so I was like, I'll use it, whatever.
for this stupid pimple. Okay. I'm about to... But yeah, I had to elevate it, the sink, and now it drains perfectly. There's no issues. It drains. There's not like a little puddle, puddle like there was before. And I just installed this, what was it, yesterday or the day before? I don't know. Anyways. I'm happy. I love it. And it's like my new favorite room at the moment. Like, <clears throat> I've just been spending time in my kitchen. I washed so many dishes the other day and I was like, oh my god. And I, like, put it to the test. I was like, can this wash, like, a big pot or pan? Um, did I mention that that faucet? I think, um, I was talking about it and I forgot. But this one's on my old, um, bathroom sink. It is, like, a regular sink faucet, but it's a bathroom sink faucet faucet that I found at a discount like um yard or whatever um so yeah so it's like a kitchen sink and it can move So, yeah. Yep. I love it. And I can still access all my drawers over there. Um, before, when I had it down by itself, I couldn't access half of these drawers. <clears throat> but now that I elevated it, now I can use all my drawers again. So that's good. Um, but yeah. I'm going to figure out what to... I might spray paint that white. And just spray paint it. Um, I don't know yet. Anyways. That's it for this video. Um, I feel like I'm forgetting to show you guys something that I don't know what it is, and um, I guess when I figure it out, I'll tell you. So, thank you for watching wherever you are in the world, and um, I truly appreciate it. And Thank you for your support. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye.